Let's see if we can get in here. Okay. How's it going guys? So we got this parasol obviously you see here, this big old parasol. We know what's in it, we can't wait to try it out today. So let's get into it and open it up. Budget cut so we don't get a knife so we're just gonna use some keys. Okay. Okay guys, so uh, maybe wondering what we got here. This is a 2020 model Beagle. And he's a beaut, his name's Henry. And one thing about Henry, he loves to go red hunting. Today we're gonna take him. I know the weather's been horrible. We've been wanting to take him for a while now. Haven't had good weather. It's either been like minus 15 or raining every day. So today's our day. We're gonna go get a couple for you guys. Our last video was super long. So we're gonna make this one quick and just show you what Henry does, so. Let's get into it, I'm pretty pumped, and I'm sure Henry is too. Okay, so I'm just gonna make it easier for you guys. When we're in the woods, it's kind of hard. I can't really explain a lot of the stuff because Henry runs away in the woods. So I illustrated it for you guys. A little insight to what really goes on here. We can pretty much break it into three steps. Okay, so step one. Here, Will, you say it. Find the sucker. Thanks, bub. Okay, so first off, we let him run to the woods and uh, he's gonna find fresh sin, but sometimes it takes a while, sometimes it doesn't. It just depends on where the rabbit's at. And once he finds it, he makes a very distinct howl. His job is to stay on it, but the rabbit also has a role in this. And that is step two, let him work. And what I mean by that is at this point, the rabbit does most of the work. Um, at an instinct, a rabbit will want to return to where it was last safe. And then once the rabbit eventually does return, we have step three, which is to be ready. And then pretty much after that, you just have to hit it. But we'll see what happens today. If we hit two, I'll be like fired up. Get going. Like over there looks really good in that stuff. Like where the trees get bigger here. Rabbit country. All the swampy stuff. Like it was like a little bit cheaper, so I was like, maybe I'll see that. Yeah. I, it looks more rugged too. Like I don't know, it just looks like a Does beefier it? camera. Oh. oh yeah. Oh, let's go. Yo, boy. Yo. Hey, come here. Hey, he won't listen. Come here. Come on. Come on, Bob. Hey. 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 Come here. We'll go to the next one. We can't waste another hour on this sucker. He's beat, he just beat you. That's all. That's all that happened. You just aren't as good as him. Let's see if we can get him out of here. I assume we just go that way. <laughs> Guaranteed. 
Yes! Smoke them! I don't know if he's in the He's whiter in the snow, look at him, man. <laughs> man, that's a big one. Yeah, that's huge. You. <laughs> Friggin' moved him back. <laughs> They make them big up here in Truro. <laughs> um, they look way different down home, don't they? Yeah. Like, they're like a real snowshoe hair color. Like, the ones that we get down on the south shore are like brown and white. We just gotta wait for, uh, wait for Henry to find it first. I like to get, like the dog get to it first. So. Good boy! What is that, Bob? What is that thing? Good boy! That's a big one, ain't it? Get it, swim it! You want to make me late for my dentist appointment? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, let's get another one. Yeah, we're closer. Yeah. Maybe Okay, guys. If you're, uh, if you've been up the uh, some road in Truro and you lost your grandmother's necklace, you know where to find it because we have it now. Pretty, uh, seems pretty fake, but <laughs> if you still need it, let me know. <laughs> also, I'd pick up the rabbit by the by the back legs like I usually do, but he's uh, full of pee, and I gotta go to the dentist right now, so I don't really want to smell like pee. Grease, greasy old rabbit. Oh, we're back from the dentist appointment and got my teeth all pretty up. Thought we were gonna be done, but we're not. We're gonna try to get one more because we got a little bit of extra time. Perfect day. It's supposed to be like minus 40 at the end of the week or something crazy. So we're gonna take advantage of it being zero degrees and no wind, so. Good area. I've actually never hunted here before, but there's plenty of rabbit sign in here. So hopefully we get on one. Henry's he's doing his thing right now, so. Can you pearly white? Pearly, oh man. <laughs> pearly browns. <laughs> Uh, That's good in there. We should get in there. Oh, yeah, this is good. Oh, he's real. <laughs> To get the best spot to shoot, but I'm freaking awkward. Guarantee I'll fall when I shoot. <laughs> Here he comes. If he takes one step, he's done. Now we gotta wait. Frank. <laughs> ah. Frank. Oh, oh. I shot. I must have shot over top of it. Hurry, right, let's cut him off over here. I could have shot him like out for a while, but I could only see his gut. I didn't want to ruin him. Wait, unless I did get him. Run like I could have hit him in the heart or something. Cause he's not barking no more. Yeah, let's go see. Maybe he actually did we actually did get him. I must have shot over top of it. That's weird. Well, I'm not a no sharpshooter, but I'd say I missed him. Didn't you? Oh no, he's right here. Did? No way. Yeah, right here. <laughs> <laughs> he ran like he ran, must have ran like 30 yards. <laughs> Good boy, Bob. Good boy. 
Who is that? Is that the rabbit, bro? You walked right past it, man. You didn't even know. That one's definitely smaller. Man, I must have just hit him in the heart or something. And he just ran like, yeah. he ran a good 20 yards, I'd say. <laughs> I was like, there's no way I missed him because he was sitting there. Like, that's awesome. Good job, Bob. Good job. Can't go wrong, can you? Go rag right hunting with the, with the boys. The boys? <laughs> Come on, Bob. Was, hey, good job. You were on that fella. You were on that rabbit for like 30 minutes, man. Good boy. Looks like it. I don't know. Maybe not. Looks like a bear. The teeth look like a little different, don't they? They do look different, but I could, it could be a coyote too, I guess. Mmm. <laughs> Actually bigger than I thought. Yeah. Oh yeah. So I want to thank you guys for watching. Uh, yeah, pretty good. I'm proud of, proud of him. This is a good day for Henry. One of his best days ever. Like getting two. He's he's still young. We don't take I don't take him a ton. So just really proud of him. And uh, we were gonna cut it at one. I went to the dentist, but anyways, I came back. I, I just had the itch to go again. So we went and got another one. And I actually shot and thought I missed it, but we went down there and he actually the rabbit ran like 20 yards before it before it uh, fell over so anyways we got two pretty proud of him and uh since he got his record today we found this necklace in the woods which you would have seen earlier in the video but we're gonna give it to henry an honorary record medallion bob get him all iced out there you go bob man what a swaggy boy <laughs> Anyways, I just want to thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for our next video. And uh, yeah, like, subscribe. And I hope you guys are liking our content. So made this one a little bit shorter just to pay it forward for you guys to have to watch a 26 minute, minute video there of us duck hunting. So thank you guys. And uh, we'll see you next time. Come on, bud. Come on. Come on. Go in. Oh, uh, it's going to be picked up. Oh. Uh, I'll show the, show the change of the camera, bud. You want to show them? Iced out. <laughs> As you can see, he's uh he's a house dog. He's got his own bed and yeah, he's not he's no rugged hand, I can tell you that. But he likes to go rabbit hunting, that's all that matters, right Bob? Get in there. Hop in the car, watch it go vroom. Vroom. I told him that I was soon. Soon. Know it's a child back in the room. Yeah. Oh.